science for another beer review this time we've got a can of forest fruit sour from the crate brewery it's a little small can design there and this is coming in at 4.7 percent ABV um, I picked this up in one of my local bottle shops cottage wines some of you may have been some you may not check it out brilliant uh, bottle shop for all your craft beers European beers American beers everything that's popular at the minute. Never heard of the Crate Brewery, but apparently they're from Hackney Wick in London. So let's see what their sour's like. I'm actually looking forward to this because I'm getting a bit bored of IPAs. I like sours, and a forest root sour sounds lovely. So I'm hoping for good things. I'm 4.7, it's a good strength. I'm liking the colour. Big head. Ooh, instant smell of raspberry right off that. Ooh, ooh. Big black currant smell. Raspberry. Hint of strawberry. Blackberry. Oh, it smells like um, yeah, like a forest fruit gatto or forest fruit pie or something like that. Blackberry pie. Oh, that's lovely. So nice to smell something different. That's not IPA like, you know, the typical smells and flavors. Oh, that's lovely smell. I hope it tastes just as good. Almost a hint of like, like mince fruit, you know, that sort of, or like a mince pie that you get at Christmas. And I'm not a fan of mince pies. Yeah, black currant is a predominant smell. Oh, that's a lovely smell. Oh, really looking forward to this. Cheers. wonderful the, there's more in the smells because it's sour and that is a big sour actually for a change as soon as it hits your tongue it, it attacks it that sourness with a subtle hint of bitterness really drying on the palate then the black one comes over delicious black currant raspberry blackberries it's so sour it's like there's a subtle hint of mint sauce if you ever tried mint sauce like a little tiny bit of vinegariness now I know sometimes that's when it's over the sour or, or whatever but that's just nice. I can't get that sort of minced fruit out of my nose. It smells better than it tastes but it adds to it because that, that sourness is the after bit. Or oh, if you take it all in at once, a big sniff and it. And it and and take a big gulp of it not even a gulp of it just a good drink not a good sip Ooh. yeah that is absolutely amazing tis the more oh, sorry is the hour for this forest fruit sour 
let's have a look cute refrigerated and drinks so fresh and so clean clean taste notes a sharp tart and super refreshing sour beer fermented with copious quantities of juicy forest fruits well they definitely come through it says ingredients water wheat malted barley blueberry cherry raspberry blackberry black currant hops and yeast <coughs> Ooh. interesting can design it's like they've just doodled on it and the writing's all the same getting a slight biscuity aftertaste which probably comes from like the yeast and everything in there now mm. that's very nice oh, that's definitely one of the best beers I've tried this year and that's going straight up there with one of my favourite sours Crate Brewery Forest fruit sour. I'm going. To, I'm definitely going to get some more of these. Definitely, if you see it, get some. And I tell you what, I never even went out for this, and I saw it in the local bottle shop or whatever can shop. And I saw it there, and I was like, like a sour beer. Want something different for a change? Um, never heard of them, so another good reason to try them. It's sessionable, 4.7. Yeah. I'm so glad I picked up this and I'm definitely going to get some more and it was a very very good price as well um, brilliant value for money for that if you ask me compared to everything else so out of 10 uh, it was £2.50 sorry £2.50 for a can of that and I thought that was very good compared to what everything else is sort of priced at really uh, so out of 10 Crate Brewery Forest Root Sour I'm going to give that I'm going to give that a 10 out of 10 because th that's a really, really nice sour. Brilliant flavours, nice flavoured beer. Um, beating a lot of the typical IPAs or like a cherry sour or something like that to get those forest fruits in there. And I think they've done that perfectly and a brilliantly tart sour flavour. And yeah, and the aftertaste of the yeast, so, and really good value. So definitely get it, try it. 10 out of 10 from Science. I'm definitely going to go away and enjoy the rest of this. Thanks very much for watching. See you next time.